All hail the beard, it's your boy Big Beard B and we back for another edition of Big Beard Business. In today's video, we're discussing three common sweat related issues so you don't sweat sweat in the summer. Beardos. See, many of us dread the summer not because the heat it brings, but because the sweat it brings. I mean, I guess sweating is a good thing, it cools your body down, but who am I kidding? It sucks. So without further ado, let's get into a few ways to make sweating less sucky. So the first thing I think about when I think about sweating is how much you stink. The stench of sweat is terrible. So with that said, you gotta keep your hygiene intact. But before you go out into the spring and summer heat, make sure that your hygienic routines are up to par. This would include bathing, taking regular showers, and depending on how active you are, you might need to take a few showers per day. This also includes staying ahead of overwhelming body odors. So you wanna make sure that you're using antiperspirants, deodorants, and odor blocking powders. See at their base, all these products are good for keeping body odor at bay. These products, Pair with the fragrance that's primed to do well in the summer and spring heat will definitely keep you smelling fresh all day. For cologne ideas, feel free to check out my spring cologne video listed and linked in the description box below. So another common sweat related issue is skincare. Developing and maintaining a proper skincare routine is going to be essential during high heat months where you're likely to sweat. If you don't have a proper skincare routine, when you're sweating you're more likely to clog your pores. Any sweat from the scalp can pull down hair product into the face which can clog the pores and irritate the skin. If you have a face wipe handy, that will allow you to clear your pores a little more quickly, which should reduce your odds of breaking out. And last on the list, which probably should be number one on the list, is swamp ass. So what is swamp ass? Have you ever noticed moisture in a chair after you or someone you know has gotten up from a seat? Well, hello, that's swamp ass. So swamp ass occurs when your ass is sweating too much. You know, it's like really sweaty, like, really sweaty, like a nasty sweat. And look, you might have swamp ass and not even know it. So here's the test. You sit down on the chair, get up, look back. If it's moisture there, you got swamp ass. If it's not, you're good to go for now. So as a man, how can you avoid this issue? Well, it's quite simple. You can avoid this by wearing higher quality, form-fitting, breathable, absorbent underwear. The technologies in these type of underwear will allow the moisture to be absorbed from the skin and evaporated through the fabric. In addition to a high quality underwear, a high quality talcum powder will also help reduce a sweaty ass. Get that swamp ass out of here. I hope you guys are able to use these three tips to help you stop sweating, sweating. It's your boy Big Bear B. Like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend that we back again. Hit that goddamn bell. So let's say I got a hypothetical gun to your head. Do you hit the bell or no? Yeah. 